At first glance, the view depicted in Risedale's painting, Landscape with Bridge, Cattle and Figures, is relatively unremarkable. There are no spectacular mountains, no waterfalls, no scenic wonders for us to gaze upon in awe. The painting looks like an incredibly naturalistic, but straightforward representation of the countryside, unspoiled and untamed, except for the rather rickety footbridge that allows the figures and animals to cross from one bank of the stream to the other. But if we look at the painting for a little longer, we might begin to see all kinds of things. The young saplings on the extreme left-hand edge of the canvas contrast with the more established middle-aged trees on the higher ground to the right. The curve of the bridge leads our eyes from this rocky promontory back across the foreground to the dead tree on the stream's left bank, where we will find a number of rectangular stones that resemble grave markers in a cemetery. Maybe this painting is more complicated than it seemed at first. Like many 17th century Dutch landscapes, Risedale's paintings were often both convincing views of the countryside and subtle metaphors for human life. The journey the figures are making is symbolic as well as geographical. Their lives may be fraught with potential danger, and in the end, death comes to everyone. But Risedale's painting offers hope, too. New green shoots can be seen around the trunk of the dead tree. This splendidly naturalistic landscape was probably painted for a patron who shared Risedale's belief in a life after death. Its symbolic meaning doesn't intrude, but it may be there for anyone who chooses to look for it.